Paano ba mag-budget? There are four things that has to be checked. The first one is what we call purpose. Before you buy a certain thing, ask yourself, do you need this thing or do you want it? A need is something that you cannot live without. A want is something that you can live without. What are the things that we cannot live without? Very good example, utilities, di ba? Kuryente, tubig, pagkain, shelter. Those are the basic things. What if you need something? Kailangan mo ng cellphone. Example, we all need cell phones nowadays. And you also want to have an iPhone. Of all the things that you can buy, you can buy a different Android phone, Samsung bayan, Oppo bayan, Vivo bayan, whatever brand, but you prefer to have an iPhone. So you need a phone. Kasi siguro sira na yung phone mo ngayon, it's malfunctioning, it's not working well, then you can combine the two. It makes sense eh. Kailangan mo siya, and you can also combine it with what you want. After the purpose is the design. Yung itsura ng product. One of the challenges of most people is this. They tend to buy things that they don't want because that's the only supply na meron. Gusto mo ng bag na color black. Example lang. Tapos, nakita mo, ah, ang available lang is color gray. Kailangan mo ng bag, pero hindi mo gusto yung design. Pinilit mo yung sarili mo to buy that certain bag. Even if it's not the color that you want. So, bumili ka ng color gray. So, what ends up happening? When you see that there's a black bag, bilhin mo na yun ulit. So, instead of having one bag, you have two bags. Therefore, you've spent two twice as much. Pangatlo, dapat quality. Ito, my personal take on this is it's much better that you spend a little bit more money provided that the product that you're going to buy is of quality. Rather than purchasing a product that you know for a fact that it's not quality, tapos after how many years or months lang, masisira siya. In the long-term perspective, you can save more money actually. You spend more money upfront, yes, but in the long term, mas nakakatipid ka. I purchased a fake pair of shoes. It was 800 pesos. Now, it only lasted for a month. What I did was, I bought another fake shoe, another 800 pesos. After one month, it's still na siya. So after two months, I spent one six. I went to Bees. I saw this black pair of rubber shoes. Tapos tinanong ko yung salesperson. If I'm going to use this pair of shoes every single day, how long will this last? Sabi niya, sir, it's going to last for around three years, maximum. It's 2,800 pesos, but since it's on sale, naging 1.8 na lang siya. So at the back of my mind, 1,800 pesos, you divide it by three years, kasi yun nga yung lifespan ng pr product, that's how I do the math back then. So 1.8 divided by three, that's 600 pesos for a year. Unlike 800 pesos na fake, and it lasted for a month. Last, but definitely not the least, look at your finances. If you cannot afford paying for it, do not buy it. Ganun lang.